How do I know it's even going? Hmm. Hello, testing, testing. Testing, testing. Oh, okay. Um. Yo! <laughs> oh, shoot. You can hear my own thing. <laughs> the goddess deemed me worthy. I regained my body and my life. And my hope was restored. I thought a joyful future awaited me, but all that I found was empty silence. What awaits you? Show me one night in the story of your life, you who have lost everything. happening at the start there but I'm glad I actually got it working so this is Zoe this is my occult whore and I am very appreciative for everyone that showed up Trinity, Azure, Hatch welcome everyone alright let's go ahead let's begin oh my goodness I, whew, I can't believe I finally got that working was not expected either. Ooh. All righty. A bad dream. Oh my, where are we heading now? Oh, shoot, there we go. Can I move? Oh. <laughs> it's a giant kiwi monster of my nightmares. <laughs> oh, that thing is disturbing. All right. Oh. As doing unspeakable actions against me. Oh yeah. No, this game I saw it. It's mobile, believe it or not. It, it is. Um it says horror in it. It is a type of horror game. There are some jump scares. It's not the same kind of horror. Tap to examine things. And I'm sorry, you will hear a delay. I'll just go ahead and send that to the chat. <laughs> um, but there is a delay. I, I don't know why, but I can't control it. All right, but there's a note on the desk. It says, leaving the room is forbidden. All right, fair enough. There are rows of books on the goddess's teachings. They all deal with different top difficult topics, like what love and mercy truly are. That masked man tries his best to teach me about the parts I don't understand. But I'm not very interested in it. Presented by fuming or fumming. I'm assuming it's fuming. We got, um. Has it already been a week since I was locked in here? This picture was taken when I first came to this castle. Who in the world is the masked man behind me in this picture? I have no idea what his goal is. But he loves me like I'm his own child. Except he won't let me out of this room. Just like most parents. They never let you leave. Ever. Ever, ever, ever. Okay. What's in here? The drawer full of underwear. They're all folded nicely. Because we don't wear underwear in this household. 
All right, yeah, that's fair. I've seen some people, though, the streams are almost instant. I don't know how they get that. The moon's glowing beautifully. It's a full moon tonight. The window is unlocked, but looking down freezes my feet in place. Ooh. <laughs> huh? I think I heard the door unlock. What's up here first? Zele. Oh, look at the little bird guy. What's up here, though? It's Nocturne Castle. It's a pretty famous castle around here. But no one goes close to it because it's rumored to be haunted by evil spirits. Will I die here? Yikes. It's unlocked. Leave the room? Yes. Freedom at last. The game is saved every time you move. Okay. I love the music, not gonna lie. It's a good atmosphere. I hope everything is, um... Ooh! Okay, this is cool. It's not just, the uh, touch, um... Oh, shoot, I keep missing it. The door's locked. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I keep missing it. It isn't just a touch interaction that's seen. You're moving around in, like, almost a 3D space. I like that. Oh, hello, little bird man. Hi. Good, good. Oh, he's gone. Oh, he? I'm guessing that is to our room. I love the... Oh. Ah. Hi, sir. I, I think I just saw something outside the window. Nah, it's our imagination. It runs rampant. I like how we just throw the key to the side. The goddess. Ooh. It's a statue of an angel. It feels nice and smooth. Where are you, Hatch? I appreciate it. <laughs> Unfortunately, my other stream, I accidentally muted myself. And I, um... I was talking to myself the entire time. I feel so bad. But this time I fixed it. Nice and smooth, you say? My skin is one of my best features. <laughs> huh? It's nice to meet you. You may call me Miss Goddess. I've descended to this earthly world just to meet you. Hmm, from what I can tell, you tried to continue onward to escape from this castle, right? I'm sure your mother is waiting anxiously for your return as well. But many evil spirits live in this castle, so it would be dangerous to wander around empty-handed. And that is why I have prepared this for you. Oh! On! Oh, Hatch, you were on reality, weren't you? Like, from today? Oh! I didn't know your name was Hatch on here. You called something else, weren't you? Well, I'm glad, though, you could make it. It was really fun talking with you earlier. That is why I have prepared this for you. Ooh, a rosary. It works simply enough. When you are attacked by an evil spirit, the rosary screen will appear like so. There are three colors in all. It's very cute. Tapping on the rosary that matches an evil spirit's color will red. I mean, calm them down. Ooh. Is it both? Oh my gosh. I'm horrible at names, dude. I am so sorry for that. I am terribly freaking sorry for that. Um, uh, yeah, we're just gonna- we're just calming them down. We're not killing them. Look closely into your opponent's eyes to determine their color. Once you know their eye color, tap the rosary with the same color. You only have a limited amount of time, so be careful and swift. See? Perfectly simple. That's all there is to it. Do you understand? Yes, Mama. It seems you have got the idea. I'm glad. No need to worry. I'm sure you'll get used to it once you use it. There was one other thing. Oh, that's right. I need to give you a map of the castle. Here you are. Ooh, map of the castle. <laughs> he looks like Duolingo, honestly. Not wrong. You can open it at any time by tapping the map icon screen. Tapping it. It's not opening. Oh, it 
gives you a good layout of the castle, so use it when you're lost. I hope you can return home soon. This is all I can do for you. Ooh, I don't like the way you're looking at me, Kitty. I appreciate if you don't look at me like that. I'll be praying that it all goes well. Huh? It's a good thing you were able to get the rosary before moving on. You must be quite fortunate. It looks like a demon has already come to kill you. You can't escape now. Ah, she is not- Oh! Okay. Well, that's not bad at all. See, guys? He's not eradicated. He's just calm down. Just... Ooh, angry. <laughs> wonderful! Absolutely wonderful! You were able to wield the rosary power perfectly. I apologize for putting you through such a tri sudden trial. I just had to know if you had the aptitude to wield it. But it seems there was no need to worry. I'm so eager to see how much you'll grow. Oh, I'm just beside myself with excitement. Now then, I'm looking forward to see forward to the time when we'll see each other again. <laughs> Ooh. I I don't think she's I don't think she's on our side. Yeah, I, I don't think She's a good person. Let's check out our map. Ooh, there's something on it. It looks like there's a note. There looks like there's a note on the bottom of the page. I can read it by tapping on it. Tap. The view from the top is superb. The moon and stars are dazzling. I wonder if I can make it outside by leaping from here. It looks rather high up. I'd be a laughing stock if I joined the heavens like that. I sure forget about it. Well, joke's on you, sir. One man's regret is another pan person's treasure. Yeah, I agree. She's a little crazy. We are now going to the top of the building. And we're going to take a leap of faith. Oh, we went the wrong way. We're going to take a leap of faith from the tippy top. They were too chicken, but we can do it. Oh. Oh, we can't do it. Never mind. Well, we tried. <laughs> Alright, let's go back. What happens if I click her again? Did she yell at me? It's a statue of an angel. It doesn't look like Miss Goddess is going to come out. <laughs> she has to deal with Duolingo. Honestly, if I had to deal with a little Duolingo every day, I might go insane too. Oh, it changes. How, just how much time has passed since I began living here. It seems things have taken a turn for the worse as I whiling away in time. This place wasn't nearly as menacing when I first came here. At any rate, it looks like I'll need to get out of here quick. My intuition is always right. Especially when it comes to my sniffing out danger. <laughs> when I have to deal with doing it at all. I remember, ooh, hello. Well, I remember um, dealing with Duolingo and all that. It's not. Is this some kind of scarecrow? I feel like it's looking at me. Nah. Just our imagination. I try to open the window, but it won't budge. Okay. I'm not strong enough to open it. Oh, it is looking at us. Ooh. Ooh, I don't like that. Sir, please stop staring at me. Let's run. Run, 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 run. Run. Oh, something's moving. Yeah, I feel like something's right behind me. Yeah, it's called run. Run. No, we don't stop and turn. Don't stop and turn. Run. It looks like you. Uh, I don't want to turn around. Oh, well. Hello. Hello, Azura. Welcome. Oh. Hmm. So, I wonder if that's going to Oh. Oh, what a way to... Oh, I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry for the way you went out. A necessary sacrifice for the stream, though. Oh, 
Oh, uh, that was crap. That was unexpected. Oh, it's easy to go past these doors. Hello? It's a picture of a young man. Is he the one who lives in this room? Oh, his eyes. He's bleeding. Oh, I'm trying to... Oh. Okay, my bad. I'm trying to see the drawers. There's nothing in the drawer. Oh. Looks like there's a note on a scrap of paper. Don't end up like me. Ooh, what a threat. The wardrobe is empty. Let's go in the bathroom! Something's glittering in the bottom of the toilet. I don't think I can reach it with my hand. Oh, joke's on you. Strong-willed people reach in the bottom of toilets. Let me tell you, the way to survive any horror situation is to insert your hand into every hole you see. It works. Nine times out of ten. One, two, ooh. A, I don't want to go out there. What's in here? Book on the desk. Read it? Yes. Adolf's note. Every so often, the demons living in hell show their horrid forms on earth, repeating a cycle. However, many of those who are labeled as demons are actually sinners who have fallen into hell. Their souls finally obtain relief as they rot away after an eternity of torture, but their compounded rage and hatred alters them into beings whose sole hurt desire is to burn the world down. And when hell becomes too full, they overflow onto the earth. It is the duty of those chosen by the gods to drive those demons back. But they are nothing more than disposable pawns burdened with a grave responsibility. If what that reaper with the avian mass said is true, am I too a mere pawn? Oh wow, pretty sad. That's a deer head, yep. All right, we are gonna not go out the right. We're going down this way. Ooh, hello. You look like the creature we killed earlier. Strange, his eyes are missing. I guess it's not evil? I don't know. Yeah, Adolf is a little crazy. But I wonder if he's talking about the goddess in a way. Because she did not seem the most best of heart. It's a painting of a knight with a sword. Ah, this room, the slash marks all over the room. All they said it before me. It's have been through some rough times. A wilted rose, its stem was cut with a giant sword. It's way bigger than me. Got a butterfly now. Oh, this is for the bathroom. Uh-oh. Uh oh uh oh <laughs> Oh. My concern is like, ooh. Be gone, demon. Pacify. Oh. See, he relaxed so much his eyes. Way a service from us. That's what I call good service right there. Relax so much your eyes melt. Um, my concern right now, oh wait, is that the game, the rosaries, the, um, oh no, I did have to go this way. I'm stupid. That it might be just the same thing over and over again, but it's too soon to tell. COVID. <laughs> Honestly how this house is looking, I wouldn't be surprised if we went through COVID. There's a lot of germs, people. Maybe, in fact, everything we see around us is people infected with COVID. Eee. Oh, I am not a fan of that sound. Got eye jewels. Woo! Lovely eye jewels. The butterfly net broke. It must have gotten flimsy from rock. I won't be able to use it anymore. Wow. They don't make things like they used to, that's for sure. Gosh darn, everything's breaking. I'm not even using it that much. Message retracted. Some kind of eyes are missing. But the eye jewel's in it. It looks like a creature, but it has blue eyes. Ooh. Hello. Ancient tales about cherished dolls gaining souls. But what happens to dolls that have been forsaken, shut alone in dark rooms? No, dolls are just dolls. It's impossible for them to gain souls either way. That's just 
unthinkable. Yeah, this place is a little gritty. Yeah. The deeper we go, the little more unsettling it is. Let it seal tight. The side is filled with dust. I don't want to touch it. No, nope, it's also tight. The tighter it is, the better. The better, the better. Is that an air vent? It has a metal cover. Screw the place. Key is hanging on the wall, but it's too high up for me to reach. There's a big hole on the floor. Take a peek. Yes. I can't see the bottom. It looks pretty deep. Interesting. Yeah, we're just gonna get out of there. I guess we gotta go forward. Oh! There are two headless dogs. I don't wanna go in here. Ah. All, bo all bodies attached to each other. It's a classic centipede. I got a rod! Oh, uh oh. Uh, uh oh. Oh, I hear that skedaddling. Oh, where'd it go? Is that an air vent? The, over the cover's off now. Going to air vent? Yes. Too small for me to fit. Uh, we're, we're not gonna comment on the doll disappearing in front of us. You know what? Sure. Whatever. Let's just let's, let's go. Let's run before it kills us. Oh wait, hold on. We have to. We have to. <laughs> we have to go in here. Sorry. I keep going past the doors. I'm pretty sure this hook. We get this. The key is hanging on the wall. Yeah, the key is right. Yep. I can't quite get it. Gosh darn it! Us on our short limbs. party. Oh! Oh, it's eating! Oh, shoot! Oh! Oh! Oh, our first death on the stream. <laughs> so, the, the puzzles do change over time. I got too comfortable. My bad. I gotta expect the unexpected. Don't worry, guys. I will for sure kill the flying disco ball this time around. I am not expecting pleasantries with this man. Alright. Just stop being short. Oh, it just, oh, I got it. oh, okay. Hold on. That one's a little hard, not gonna lie. <laughs> the only issue with live streaming is I can't hide all my struggles from you. Because you see everything that I go wrong with. <laughs> you see how horrible I am. I can't hide it. I wish I wasn't short. Maybe that's why the disco ball is trying to kill me. Okay, this time for sure we got this. This will go better than the Toho live stream. I know what you're going to do now, sir. Boom! Bam! Dead. Oh, he's not dead. He's just going away now. That's like the best death we've had. Oh. That's so too soon. Yeah, yeah, a lot of papers. Well? Oh, we got the key now. Can we see his body down below? Alright. Well. Actually, this game. Uh, so, I thought this game was free and I accidentally bought it. Not going to lie. But on mobile, it's only four bucks. Oh, oh shoot. Got it. Yeah, it's only four dollars for this game. And so far, it's really proving its worth. Don't ask me how I thought it was free. At least it was a $4 game and not like a $100 game I accidentally bought. Well, I guess we have to go out to where we saw that evil creature at. It's unlocked with the moon key. I don't need this key anymore. Well, so far, so good. Well, hello, weird man sleeping. Let's just snoop your room a little. There are a bunch of different books on the shelves. They all look really difficult. 
It's a painting of the moon against the starry night. Yeah, I agree. It's really not a bad price. The fire is crackling close up to me. The door is locked. Can I peek in the room through a keyhole? Should I peek in? Yes. Oh. Kind of a creepy room. You don't say. Yikes. It looks like someone's dungeon. Okay. Well, let's wake up. I like the little, the pop of the little note here. What a small guest I have. You're so cute and tiny. A young boy. Oh, I remember now. You're the boy who recently came to this castle, aren't you? Oh, I've been wondering about you for a while. Yeah, I agree. Moon Man looks really cool. But the real problem here is, how did you get into this room? I do believe I had the door locked. I suppose that hardly matters. I understand your desire to go on a pretend adventure. I truly do. But this castle is much more dangerous than you might think. Do you not know the rules set out by the Reaper who made this place? I don't. Oh, you don't know? How sweet. This castle is forbidden to leave your own room. Horrible, isn't it? Dreadfully boring, don't you think? Yeah, he is kind of The faces he makes remind me of Hisuka. But the world outside your room is filled with peril. So, si es la vie. Any, any foreign speakers able to translate that? would be great. So watch yourself on that little adventure of yours or else. You might just get eaten. Ew. How sweet. At any rate, I think it's best for you to scurry on back to your room. If the reaper finds you, there'll be trouble. Why do you keep looking over in that creepy room? Hello? Oh, we can ask him questions. <laughs> uh, the reaper. Who's the reaper? Who's the reaper? Curious, aren't you? Piques your interest, doesn't it? You've seen him, haven't you? A masked man in a black robe. That's the Reaper, and the master of this castle. He supervises all of us. Though in this case, that means he safeguards us. And under his tutelage, we spend our days preparing to ascend to heaven. We learn the goddess's teachings to testify about ourselves, try to find the right way to live. We acknowledge our crimes and repent. We purify our hearts, all to ascend to heaven. The Reaper is unique. He's not like other Reapers. <laughs> the Moon Man looks like me. You won't be able to find any other Reaper who preaches the Goddess's teachings. He's an oddball, that's for sure. But perhaps the light seems all the brighter to those who live in the world of darkness. Now hurry back to your room, boy. That's the rule around here. And besides, the world outside your room is extremely treacherous. I have another question. Who are you? Me. I'm me and you're you. What more is there to be said? And what would you do if you knew? No, wait. Allow me to apologize. I shouldn't have said it like that. I just don't want us meddling in each other's affairs. You're better off not getting involved with you want to live a peaceful life, don't you? Oh, sorry, but that's a downright lie. I'd love to savor a nice long chat with you, among other things. But I'll just have to keep e to exercise some self-control. Now go on back to your room, boy. By the way, about that rosary you have there. I thought it was just a toy, but it looks like a... The rosaries of humans calling themselves exorcist wheel. But I sense some kind of power coming from it. Alright, Azor. Make sure you get some good food. Bring some for the rest of us. <laughs> it's clearly unlike the ornaments they hold. It's not an ornament. It's truly a rosary, you say. Now where did you get a thing like that? Looking at that rosary turns my stomach. Ugh. I'm sorry to cut our conversation short. But I need to go lie down in that inner room for a while. 
you absolutely must not go in. Just, just hurry back on your own room already, please. Now, if you would excuse me. Alright, everybody. I vote we go ahead and be leaving Peeking Toms. Because, uh, that room was a little suspicious. What in the world is he doing? Yeah, I wonder too what he's getting. But judging from the room, um. <laughs> oh my gosh. E, what is he doing? Look again? Yes. Oh, the moon ma mace is gone. The three times the charm? Yes. Oh, shoot. He saw us. Run. 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 You don't see me, but I'm clicking the thing so- Ah! Run, 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 run. <laughs> Come on, we gotta run. You saw, didn't you? Time for a spanking. Sir, I'm not into that kind of role play. <laughs> Carrying around such a weapon. What a naughty boy. Kids like you need a spanking. <laughs> Who would have thought you've been a bad boy? Oh, we didn't get the screen like before. Maybe he's not dead. I'm not into the role play. I'm not. Okay, let's sneak out this room. The wardrobe is knocked over and the mirror's broken. The room's a real mess. Got screwdriver. It's empty frame. Picture been torn out. There's a book on the floor. Read it. Yes. Regular conversation between the Reaper and the Mate-Faced Man. <laughs> Come now. Why would I be brought into a place like this? It's like a detention center. Surely there must be some mistake. After all I've done for the world, this is too much. Don't you think, Mr. Strangely Masked Reaper? <laughs> I jest. I apologize. I have an inkling. If you want to hear about my past again, right? Yes, yes. Now, let's see here. Once upon a time, before I died, I worked at an orphanage. I looked after children who had lost their parents. Isn't that ever so... Mag... Mag... Magnanimous... Magnificent? <laughs> I'm sure the children thought of me as a parent. They were so terribly adorable. Their smiles were the sweetest in the world, and their skin positively glowed. But one can't be taken in by their cuteness. It's a parent duty to properly educate them. Are you, And you must punish them every once in a while, yes? Oh, those were the most wonderful times. At first, I thought the children were happily accepting my loving punishment, but I was wrong. Gradually, as I punished them more and more, their bodies and hearts were damaged. The animosity in their eyes, just remembering it sends a shiver down my spine. No, I feel guilty. In the end, I left the orphanage so that I wouldn't hurt the children anymore. But I'll never know, I'll never forget how elated I felt back then. Yes, it's disgraceful, really. Surely I must have possessed Surely I must have been possessed by some kind of demon. Or perhaps it was due to my temperament. Or could it have been both? I have yet to find the answer. Oh, well he went through a lot. I don't know. I feel torn on him. Hatch, you can't just repeat, retext the word in the chat and pretend you said it right after you, when you did say it out loud. That's not how it works. I feel like that's cheating right there. That's why I paused earlier because I was going to respond, but I wanted to wait till after I read. Uh, he hello? Oh. Sir. Oh! It's too bad! Fudge! Darn it! Oh! Everyone pretend I did this first try, okay? Please, for me. No one has to know except for us, okay? <laughs> oh, I got it.
Yeah, I agree, sir. He went to. Oh, oh God. Oh, God. Let's go forward. I do like how it's not just touch when you go into a room, it's kind of feels like 3D ish. Where you're exploring everything. I have to go down. Yeah, there's that down here. <laughs> you're right. You, you get it, sir. You get it. I haven't failed once. I have done this perfectly. First try. Yeah, take the cover off. inside the wall. I should be able to fit inside. Go in the air vent? I guess. Uh, that looks narrower than the other one, but if he says we fit. What's failing? <laughs> Ooh. Oh wait, what did I pass? I wonder where this vent goes. It's too narrow for me to fit. Oh, uh, I guess that's where the baby came from. I feel some kind of presence. Turn around! Turn around! No, no, no! Turn around! No, I clicked it when it was blue! I clicked it when it was blue! Ah! Oh, the pain! Oh, shoot, dude. Ah, uh, that's rough. I need better reflux, right, reflexes. Alright, baby. I can take you. I have my finger closer to the screen to tap faster. Apparently, my reflexes are poor. Yeah. It was blue. It was blue. Okay, I want to wait till the second pass of blue to hit it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Not the baby. This is the, the boss that I'll never be able to beat. This is the final end. This is the end of the stream. <laughs> the baby's too powerful. It, it flashes really quick, though, dude. Oh my god, that's my, Yeah, it flashes really quick. I, I'm glad the- Ooh. Eve. Oh, that's awful. It's kind of like, like a penguin. <laughs> Why did you say reflux? Reflux is vomiting. I don't need to vomit. Not enough room to open the map. Interesting. <laughs> it's reflex, not reflux. Wait, did I say reflux? I don't know. Oh, what's wrong with this room? Hello, what does he have to say? I saw something repulsive walking around the hallway. Thankfully, it didn't notice me, but it was a ghastly sight. It does see me. I'm done for. I doubt I'd even be able to move. I may have gained the power over the rosary, but I'm only human. I'm only human. After all, don't put the blame on me. I'm sorry. The chair has slashes in it. It's a shredded chair in disrepair. <sighs> Hatch, you gotta point out my weaknesses. It's a creepy painting. I don't really want to look at it. The title is written on the frame. Tile B, fourth gen, self-portrait. I said that correctly. It's a creepy painting. I don't. Oh, wait. What happens? Ah! What if we stare at it? If you notice, he has beautiful eyes. Well drawn. Perfectly. Facial structures of gorgeous. Like a like a Chad. Like a fine gentleman. Like a Greek god. Alright, let's go. <laughs> the jar is full of tools I've never seen before. and They're covered in a dark red rust and don't look usable. Are we sure it's rust? I don't know if it's rust. Hey, how do you know the baby's dead? Alright. There is no proof the baby died. Oh, this is a little spooky. What's in here? Oh, hello. Wooden board with holes in it. It's hanging on the wall. It's a butch up. The box won't open. Actually, it looks like there's a padlock keeping it shut. Yeah, there's no proof the baby's dead. Alright, for all we know, the head just rolled off. It's a giant pendulum. No, wait. It has a blade. What in the world is this? And what's this? It looks like some kind of wooden bed. There's leather belts attached to the ends. Looks like a torture chamber of 
not fun. Let's leave. Ooh, a mirror. There's a mirror on the wall. Look at it, yes. Ooh, look at our pretty reflection. I see my reflection. Very static point. Very nice. Whoa. You just don't move. It'll be fine. It's all in our head. It's all, it's all in our head. I can't move around. It it didn't even let me move during that. I tried to turn around. It didn't let me. Is there something behind me? No. Okay, see, it's just in our head. Just in our head. Oh, we have nothing to say about out here. Let's go down here. Ah, another spooky corridor. It's a painting. It titles Restless Night. There's a moon-shaped hole. Interesting. It's a painting. It's titled Fading Hope. And it has a sun-shaped hole. Interesting. I don't know what the eyes all over the ground are supposed to represent. Oh, he has writing. To be honest, there is one magic spell I can use. A black, a black magic spell that can open locks. It's pretty handy. I know that black magic is supposed to be outlawed, but... No one could possibly blame me for resorting in a situation like this, right? That's fair. <laughs> Those damn mental disorders. Whoa, this room's a little trippy. Hello? Oh! It's a cut rabbit doll. It's really colorful. Oh, oh, rat statue, don't mind me. A picture of a green creature, huh? Something's written underneath. My mom said the power to create things that don't exist in this world is called magic. The power of magic can make people smile, but I guess I can make them sad too. The creature I made with magic was squishy and cute, but it also had the power to make people sad. I haven't seen it around in a while. I wonder where it went. Oh. <gasps> oh, it squeaks! Oh! <laughs> Why is the squeak so perfect? It's the masked man and a kid. They seem to be having fun. Well, this just makes me think everything's an illusion. There's a bunch of small things jumbled right inside the door. Bookshelf has books on the goddess's teachings, along with picture books. Some of the picture books I've read. <laughs> the room is identical. <laughs> oh, a toy box has a ton of stuff in it. Oh. Oh, hello, child. Who? Who are you? Well, no, I said that for the goddess. Who are who are you? I don't know. Did you come to play with me? Yes. What? Really? Let's play. Let's play. What should we do? What should we do? Oh, let's do that. But we should introduce ourselves first. My name's Loki. I'm six years old. Wait, am I seven now? Well, whatever. You look like you're my age. This castle's full of old guys, so it's super boring. Boring, boring. So I'm really happy that another kid came. Um, also, also, my favorite food is apples. And, uh, I love to dance. Wanna dance with me? Do you wanna dance? Yes. For real? Then let's dance, dance, dance. But doing a normal dance would be kind of boring. Hmm. Then we'll have a dance-off. If you win, I'll give you my treasure. <laughs> but if you lose, uh, I'll think of something when it happens. Okay, tell me when you're ready. Make sure to stretch and loosen your muscles and guts. Dance. Okay, okay. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Is your heart ready to my heart? Why does my heart have to be ready? Yes? <laughs> Alright, here we go. Thing one? No, don't say that to him. Over here to the special stage. Ooh. Very nice. Well set up. Amazing, right? It's totally sweet. This is this is the dance floor. You can dance as much as you want and do whatever you want. Okay, let's get this dance all started. Cue the music. Oh, right, we need a DJ. 
This isn't sitting, setting the right mood. Hmm. I'm going to grab the first person I can find, so you wait here. <coughs> going to eat my heart due to how cute he is. <laughs> Place bets. Sorry for the wait. Something was outside, so I nabbed it. Oh, gosh. Dolingo birds here again, guys. Okay, we should go. Good go. Yeah. Oh, you don't have to do anything fancy like that. Just hit the play button there and then fake it till you make it. Oh, that's mean. Okay, we're going to start, but do you need to hear the rules first? You need the rules, huh? Let me tell you. Dance off? I'm a pro at dance offs. I don't need the rules. Okay? We're going to win. You don't? I'm okay. All right. Let's get to it. All right. We're going to win this one, guys. Let me show you how it's done. We're going to go right first. That is our first move. Oh, boy. What? What's wrong? You made the wrong move, huh? Or were you too slow? You made a mistake, so I win. Now you got to be punished. I'll hurt you, but only for a second. What? Bye bye. You know, I just assume. <laughs> I just assumed this was just a regular dance off. Um. Apparently, we need to read the rules. Oh, well. Um. The child's not very nice. Oh, uh, we gotta skip through this again. Okay. It, it's very aggressive, I will say. I agree. I have to skip through this, though. Because I need... I need the, the rules, please, sir. I just thought it was a dance-off, but it's not a dance-off. You liar. You're a lying little child. No one likes lying children. Yes. yes. Come on, come on. Get to it. Get to it. We don't like lying children, do we, chat? I'm not a fan of lying children. That's for sure. Look amazing, right? It's totally sweet. Oh, wait. I already read this. New DJ. And we'll get that Duolingo back in. Oh, my gosh, dude. I really thought I could just do what I want, but you know what? It's my fault for not reading the rule book. I thought it would just look cooler and Duolingo decides for us. But it was a lie. Uh, hear the rules, please. Okay, I'll explain it. During the dance-off, you have to mimic my moves. Well, it's less of a dance-off and more of a mimic-off, I guess. Like, you freaking lying son of a biscuit. That's not dance-off. When the music is playing, just follow my movements. The controls are easy, super easy. Tap, play the arrow buttons. This is left. This is down, right, and up. If you make the wrong move, or you don't mimic me in time, then you get punished. Be careful. Got it, got it. Okay, let's go into it. Yeah, he is very sus. I like to see that this isn't a dance-off, it's a mimic-off, but But don't worry guys, I'm the best at mimicking people. I almost pressed the wrong thing so many times. 
Well, wow, you're awesome. You're a great dancer. I hate to admit it, but I lost. I'll give you my treasure as I promised. Huh? Where did I put that thing? Oh, he's not giving us a treasure. He lied. Oh, no, I have a promise. Gotta look around my room. You wait here. He lied to us. I thought he was gonna give us something. He's a freeloader. I hate freeloaders. I found it, found it. He's a present for me. Sun piece. Got that from the mask man. Mask man, mask man. I have a picture of him too. Got it from both of us in it. I guess he's been in this castle for a long time. He's a nice guy who gives me tons of toys, but he's always telling me to not leave this room. He says stuff like it's dangerous outside, or I gotta read books. He's had a bunch of different reasons, I guess. But I don't want to go out anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But you know, it's actually kind of lonely. I'm trying to see him all happy, but it's just an act. I'm putting up just a brave face. You know, with that dragon you summoned earlier, I have doubts, but maybe you're right. If I'm not cheerful, people won't like me. Everyone in the outside world is really scary, so... I've never, ever had any friends. Maybe don't kill them. So I'm really happy that I got to play with you in the end. Thank you so much for playing. But I don't know how to play with other people, so I'm not sure if it was any fun. I'm glad that the last person I got to meet was you. No, there's fun things even in this world. But I've decided to go see Mom. I can't stay here anymore. I hope you see your mom soon too. Oh, he's ascending! Yo, we did good! Yes, Azur, I hope you watched, studied me closely because, um... There's definitely some good dancing in there. And he took a wrap back. Oh, the eyes. Oh, does a room with eyes mean they ascended? Toy box has a ton of stuff. The rubber duck. It doesn't... Oh, it doesn't squeak anymore. Math man, locally. I want to see my mom, too. That's a picture of a green creature, huh? Something's written underneath the picture. Oh, we already read that. I thought that would change. It's not green anymore. It's red. It's a rabbit doll. Seems kind of lonely. The drawer is full of Loki's toys. Oh. Yeah. Wait a minute. If everyone else here is dead, does that mean we're dead? Question. I wonder. I don't know. Alright, we need to find the moon piece. I'm guessing that's going to be down this way. Do we have any comments over here? No. The gaze locked with a paddle. The heart shaped mark. Interesting. From what I learned in this game is we run. Ooh, pull the lever. Pull the lever, Trunks. Pull the lever, yes. Wrong me, Oh, the duck, the duck, oh, the duck went away as well. Seems like nothing happened. Might be missing a part. Oh, we have to find a gear or something. It's a section full of water. It's too dark to see the bottom. Seems pretty deep. Oh, okay, so we need uh, to do the thing for the thing. Well, I guess we missed the moon piece somewhere. Yeah, rip duck. What? There's a, there's a man. Plump man. What's a nerd voice? Hold on. Infiltration successful. Man, that was a... That wall was pretty high. The pain to get over it. Need to exercise some more. Oh, this place is depressing. Maybe they weren't flying about the creatures here. <laughs> scratch, scratch, scratch. <laughs> Monsters, give me a break. Man, I'm hungry. Better find that treasure and get out of here. I tried. Well, ugh, I mean. Well, I guess we gotta chase that. Wait, sir! Me! I, um, please give me your rope so I can get out of here. Sir? That's Peter Griffin! <laughs> sir? 
Where could he have went? Sir? I heard a yell from farther, farther inside. I think Peter Griffin might have um, be in trouble. Hello? Oh! Gone? What are you doing here, gone? Oh, ooh! Oh! Yeah, got it. Gone! You need to, you need to, you need to eat more meat. Padlock is broken open. The box is empty inside. There's nothing there. Oh, he probably opened that lock and let it out. But look at his intestines everywhere. Ooh. Ew. Poor guy. He's really dead. Hmm. Looks like he has something in his pocket. Take it? Yes. Don't worry. This is just, um... He's alive, guys. This is just a... A unique style of toilet. Yes. This is a... Um, it's very popular in France, I've heard. Um, yeah, very, very popular toilet in France. So don't threat. Oh, went the wrong way. His kid was a catfish. No, don't say that. No, no. <laughs> oh, he's a Discord mod. He came here for his... For oh, no. Oh, I passed it. Alright. Moon shaped hole. Yes. And then insert ourselves into the sun shaped hole. Yes. Gosh, no. Don't say he Discord mod. Oh, the door. It's like Star Trek. There's a cold air flowing from the crack underneath the door. Open the door. Yes. Yes, please. Oh, hello. Anything to say here? This area isn't on the map. Interesting. Oh, there's little hands coming up. Stop him. Hit him. Hit the hands. Hit him. That's the man in the mirror. Hello, handsome man. Young Greek goddess. God. Oh, he's gone. Alright, Hatch. You had to sleep. I'm really happy you were able to come. Okay, we're good. Just keep running. The faster you run, the safer we are. It's a fact. It's a heart-shaped key. Take it? Yes. Look at those cute little pigeons. Got the heart key. Go. We can't. I'll see you too, Hatch. It was really nice that you came. Have a good sleep. Oh, the pigeons are, um, they're melting. That's not normal. What happened? Ooh, I heard something. That's not normal. Run, 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 run. Ooh. I feel like something's behind me. Don't turn around. Oh. Okay. It's weird. That must have been my legend. What do you mean nothing's here? You got a weird melting thing in the sky and there's a hollow. I can't think of what those, the grand ones were called, the big tall ones, but it's, it's the hollow from bleach coming out, dude. That's not nothing. Oh, the map is dyed red. That's not normal either. Let's run. Whoa. Got you. Jesus. By the name of Jesus. <laughs> you shall fall to your knees. Ooh. Great. That's great. Well, now we have the heart-shaped key to go to that little gated area. Whoa! It's not good. Jesus. Yeah, that area really looked cool. Oh, his head exploded. Oh, what the heck? I can't get it. Oh, I got it. Oh, that's how close. Ooh, 
What a way to go. Yeah, this game for four it's really shocking this was only four dollars though. I'm not lying, like that's really dirt cheap just for what this offers, it seems. Oh, I didn't read in here. If only I had wings, I'd be able to say farewell to this place. Apparently in order to fly, humans would need to change their entire body structure. I'd rather not sacrifice my handsome looks for that. See, even though he's trapped in a desolate place, he still has his sense of humor. Alrighty. Goodness gracious. Alright, ooh, we're back down in this kind of part. Hello? Good. The door has boards all over it. I can't open it. I think I feel a window in front The outside world. From what I can see, this must be the castle's main entrance. Wait, did it say goddess on the thing and not Jesus? I don't know. I was just saying Jesus. But the door won't budge an inch. I don't think I can open it with anything I have on me either. Oh. Well, close the outside world. Oh, it worked. I got it. At last, it's mine. The goddess has deemed me worthy. My chance has finally come. My life has been blessed. My horrid, colorless life will soon be bursting over. Okay. Zogza? The plaque in the door says Zogza. Zogza. Yeah, I think that was the masked guy's name. The one who brought me into this castle. The moon shines red tonight. Oh, wait. The moon shines red tonight. Okay, as long as I'm not crazy. A red moon means that blood has been spilt. Ah, oh, how pleasant. The fragrance of blood floats in the wind. Oh. You look displeased, boy. You understand, I understand how you feel. Being shut in one room is rather stifling. And I'm forcing you to stay against your will. It's been four days now since you become, came to this old castle, I believe. Time really does fly. Have you gotten used to your life here? I want to go home. You want to go home. You say you want to see your loving mother. I understand. I really do. But you cannot. Even if you could. You must learn about the sanctity of life here first. That bookshelf contains records of the goddess's teachings. Start by reading those and educating yourself. Though, I suppose that will grow boring after a while. Is there anything else you desire? Please do not hesitate to ask me. As long as it does not violate the rules I have set in this place for this castle, I'll do anything for you. Do you want toys? Perhaps new clothes? I imagine you're tired of wearing my old hand-me-downs. Or maybe you'd like to play a game with me. I just found these card things yesterday at the human village. Seems you could play an elaborate game with them. Will you play with me? Is there nothing you desire? I want to go home. Forget about your home. If you keep saying that, I'll end up wanting to cut you into bits and pieces. Oh, well, that's uh, all the time we have for now. I should be going home. I'll come again tomorrow. Make sure you read those books, okay? Well then, pleasant dreams, my boy. Yeah, I don't like the Reaper Man either. We haven't found one good soul throughout this entire trip. Not one. Palace <laughs> people. Oh, I said that loudly. I'm sorry. Palace people. The bookshelf is full of tomes on the goddess's teachings. There are other work, weird books on demons and mysterious art too. There's a toy train. Is it for me? There's a note on the desk. Read it. Ooh, big one. <clears throat> the Reaper's notes. The castle was abandoned, perhaps because it is deep within the forest or due to the nasty rumors. The reason doesn't matter. It is incredibly fortunate that the humans shy away from this place. Here, I can finally realize my long-held dream. I can sort the souls of the dead. 
Some are destined for heaven, others doomed to hell. We reapers must ensure all sinners go to hell. But upon closer inspection, some sinners were falsely accused, or faced no other choice. There are even those we are unable to judge, unless those souls are still cast into hell. Not the most fair of systems. I cannot change this on my own, however. I will do all that is in my power to save them. Nocturne Castle is slowly gaining more residents. Each one of them has a sinful past, but they can still be rehabilitated. I will use the goddess's teachings to guide them to salvation. But if they do not heed my advice, I will once again show them my true face as a reaper. Though I dearly wish it does not come to that. Okay. There's a description underneath the painting. Astaroth, the great duke of hell. Astaroth, the great duke of hell, taught his reapers a great many mysterious arts. He is a peace-loving and kind but was once used by those with a twisted soul because of his immense power. While some say this invincible demon has some kind of weakness, the truth is shrouded in mystery. He doesn't look very nice, but I'll take his word. There are black robes folded loosely in the drawer. Underneath them are neatly folded pairs of underwear. It's a well-used piece of furniture. Nothing seems odd about it. Everything's odd in here. Now let's go into his bathroom and see what he has. Of course he has a goddess Statue the goddess. You've done well to come this far. I admire your courage. I can't believe he'd put a statue of me on a toilet. How insulting. I wish he'd stop leaving me in all sorts of weird places. He's such a creep. Oh, please excuse me. It's nothing, really. It's been quite some time. I'm Miss Goddess. Has the rosary I gave you been of any use? It must have been terrifying coming this far. I'm sure you were attacked by many demons. But you made it through. I'm sure it was because of your phenomenal courage that the power you hold. I was only able to give you a help, small helping hand, but... I believe you're one step away from escaping this castle. If you can make it through the vast forest outside the castle, you should find your village. But before that, there was something you must know. The reason why I decided to help you. And why you were trapped inside the castle with the Reaper. The Reaper, the man in the mask, hasn't told you you yet, has he? Which means, it's up to me to help you pick up the fragments of your lost memory. Are you ready? Yes. Good. Then let us be on our way. Deep into your memories. Oh, wait, I, I didn't realize you'd be brain-picking me. Please don't. I'd rather not. I'd rather not be brain-picked. Don't probe me. I don't, I'm too young to be probed. Or too old. Uh, whatever gets me on probing. Ooh, we're outside now. This is different. I see you've woken up. This is Nocturne Forest. The forest close by your village. But this is the world of your memories. You have not made it Get out of the castle. You'll likely pass along this road again when you return home. Now then, this is a very important place that holds your slumbering memories. There are things here that you must never forget. You must face those memories, become aware of them, and continue to bear them all for the rest of your life. Please press on into the forest. I, I wonder, maybe it is a coma kind of thing. Maybe we are passed out in a hospital bed? What's this? Nocturne Castle lies ahead. Beware of demons. This uh, sign says something else. I'm guessing it's a different language. Ooh, it's us. Our memories? Maybe we, this is a coma, maybe. That's a little Dolingo bird. I guess we knew them before the castle? I'm not sure. Well, there we are picking flowers. That's so cute. I do like how we're getting different gameplay too. Where it's not just um, us walking around in the one area.
my gosh, wait, hold on. I'm trying to do something. Close enough, question mark? So 
So first you need to find your corpse. No, your body at the bottom of the cliff. A miracle will happen when you pour the water from the Holy Grail into your mouth. Remember, this is just an exception, okay? Isn't that right, girl? But you mustn't repeat the same mistake, Goran. Don't ever forget there are people who would be sad if you disappeared. Anyway, this is all I can do for you. I apologize for making you remember something so painful. Please live your life to the fullest from now on. There's so many things in the world to enjoy. I'm sure he wants you to be happy too. Dang, dude. Yeah, I agree. That's really sad. I didn't expect that. I don't know. Something doesn't seem right about her. Like, cause while the goddess was tatting to Gur Gura, he didn't say anything, and he seemed like to be following her. I wonder if she took control over his body and forced him. Like, I don't know if that Holy Grail is actually a good thing. But dang, dude, we had it rough. Holy crap, I didn't expect that. Yeah, it really is sad. I agree. Well. Oh, please wait a moment. Sorry to stop you. Actually, Gura asked me to give you something. Um, I think this is it. I completely slipped my mind. I'm so sorry. But why would he give you that? Mm, well, no matter. Well then, I'll be praying for your good health. One entrusted with the Holy Grail. As you see, that it's just those faces she's doing. I don't trust them. Oh, we already read that. I'm not sure. I don't know what would cause a dragon to die at an early age like that suddenly. Maybe it is a concept of purity or something with dragons, or maybe it's just he wasn't strong enough to evolve. I know with some, uh, with some books and stuff, what they choose to do is, like, dragons, only those that are strong enough to evolve will evolve. And then those too weak to survive evolution will die. So it could have been something along those lines, but dang, dude. Sorry. Emperor's new groove is always in my head whenever I pull a lever. I heard water flowing underground. Oh, seems we can go down now. Very sloppy sounding. Hello? Oh, she didn't read. I don't know what brat did this, but you shouldn't scribble foolish things on the walls. Though I'm hardly one to talk, writing whatever comes to mind on this map, I'm only doing this to retain my sanity. Interesting. Jackpot? Interesting. Oh! I, I didn't move forward. Someone pushed us. I don't know, dude. I'm really upset that Guru died as well. Guru, not Guru. He shouldn't have died, dude. Oh, it's the Moon Man. He pushed us. Long time no see. Oh, now whatever could you be doing down in a place like that? What, you fell? Come now, you need to be more careful. It's like what they say, you should watch your step. How sweet. By the way, did you know? Once upon a time, a witch used to live in the village by this castle. She was right around the time everyone was getting crazy with all those witch hunts. So the lord of the land grew desperate and tried hunting for that witch. He locked up and interrogated every suspicious person he could ever find, but never got any evidence. Except, he had his honor to uphold, you see. So he trapped every shady-looking villager down in the castle's dungeon. They were left there with no food, no water, just stuck in a pitch-black room. Horrible, don't you think? Really makes you realize how far we've come, doesn't it? Oh, by the way, the dungeon I mentioned. Well, you're standing in it. I bet it's swarming with ghosts. What a terrifying place. It's like it's fair share of rats, too. What else could be lurking down there? <laughs> I'm so happy for you. You found so many friends. I hope you regret what you did to me for the rest of your life. 
Live out the rest of your days mirrored in terror and despair. You naughty, naughty little boy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Maybe you have a point. Maybe the goddess was the witch or something and she died as well and she's trying to enact her revenge. Perhaps. That is a good point. Door shield shut. You are good at these theories things, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Yes, yeah, place the gold statue.
rat king. Ooh, what's a rat voice? I lost that. Oh no, I lost that. No, wait. Um, I lo I lost everything. My family, my beloved, all of it. Humans are rotten pieces of filth. No way I'd go to heaven with them. I'll make this world squeaky clean. Purging against a rat job. I'll nibble away every last scrap. All we rats will cleanse it. We'll kill, eat, and multiply. A march of never-ending rats. An unstoppable swarm. We'll find every too late fiend. We'll make them scurry. We won't let them rest. We'll gnaw them to the bone. Every last scrap living neither skeleton nor teeth. Till the world's been purified. Ooh, a rat metal. This will be my final entry. My revolting castle door tour has finally come to an end. All that is left for me to find my body somewhere in a forest and to drink from the Holy Grail. May the goddesses help again. Hey, she said that was an exception. She's lying. Oh, it's really easy to get turned around in this part, though. Hello? Oh, it's an accurate depiction of the angel, right? Like, the the goddess. Like, she's a little crooked inside. There's a painting on the wall. What's it supposed to be? It's kind of a crummy painting. Crummy. How rude. <laughs> this is a painting of my beloved Miss Goddess. I spent a lot of time trying to make it get it to look just right. I mean, it does look just right. The face <laughs> matches her. The hardest part was hanging it up there. <laughs> It's been a while. I thought I told you to stay in your room. What are you doing all the way down here? In the deepest part of the castle, no less. More importantly, how did you get down here? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That thing you have there, is that a rosary? And the Holy Grail, too. Could that be? Did the Miss Goddess give, you, did, give those to you, did she? Amazing, so she did. Actually, she told me a little bit about it. I never dreamed you'd receive the blessing of the gods. It seems you no longer have any reason to stay. Shall I bless you as well, then? The gods have been potential in you, so I can't be more to hope. Oh, the room did look like a skull. You have a point. Personally, I'm delighted for you. Because you've gained the will to live. But it is terribly unfortunate that I was born a reaper. I want to lead you out of here. But my nature as a reaper won't allow me to. Just as humans cannot th stop themselves from urinating, I cannot def defy my fate as a reaper. Honestly, a good comparison. Something unsavory with something unsavory. I apologize for the crude comparison. I'll show you something cool. 
This is a reaper's scythe. Those cut by it are cast into hell. They're an essential part of us reapers, our partners. I wonder how well my partner will slice today. <laughs> Why am I joint selling this to you? In short, it's a threat. Please go back to your room immediately and forget that you were here. This is my final piece of advice. If you still insist on proceeding forward, I'll cut you. That was just a joke. I won't cut you. <laughs> oh my. Well, I guess we go forward. That one thing said, never go back. It's pitch black up ahead, but I can feel a faint breeze. Climb the stairs, yes. We're almost there. We're almost to our bodies, guys. Almost revived. Skedaddle. Let's skedaddle while we have the chance. Oh yeah, it's the place from when we were when the goddess showed us. Okay, not bad at all. Not bad at all. All right. You need some water. <laughs> yes, uh, he does look a little dehydrated. Oh, thankfully I don't have to redo that freaking, that one puzzle again. It already counted. Alright. Up we go. It's very silent to you. Oh, there he is. Oh, well, let's just keep going. Pretend we didn't see him. He said he's not going to cut us. Are you making a video right now? A live streaming, technically. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just let me know. My, my. You are certainly brave, so my threat had no effect. I can see why Miss Goddess chose you. But I won't hold back. This is truly my final warning. Give up on going home and return to the castle. I beg you, if you take one more step, I'll cast you into hell. All right. The Mirage told me to walk forward and I'll be okay. It was just a joke. I would never do something like... Blank, son of a... No, I don't want... Freaking lie to us. Where, where are we? Oh, we, we actually are going down to hell. Okay, then. Well. Well, this is what hell looks like, everyone. Something's written in white. Genesis Station. Gatekeeper of hell. Zagazo <laughs> sliced you up, huh? He always makes such a clean cut. Never leaves a scratch. That's something only a Reaper Scythe can do, you know. I'm the fairy man of this world, Zamza. I guide lost souls to where they belong. I'm a boring guy, really. We won't have much to... <laughs> Not you keep putting in the image of my head that the one guy's emo how. When she <laughs> gosh darn it, we won't know how each other for we don't we won't know each other for very long, but it's very nice to meet you. Wow, you're still just a kid though, huh? Can't believe Zogzo sent me such a young human. What a horrible thing to make someone do. The train should be here soon.
you. All aboard. All aboard. That you do you like trains? It should take us to our destination. Go ahead and hop on, boy. Everyone likes calling me boy. I've noticed that. He's your inspiration? Is that what you want to be in the future? The the guider into hell? You can no longer go back. Oof. How long have we been going for, I wonder? I'm not sure, even. Chugga. Oh, we can move now. It'll be a while the way area. We reach our destination. Why don't you look around the train window while you wait? Okay, let's look out the window. He lied to us. We're too short, gosh darn it. You know what I just realized? That one older guy that we see in the continue screen and that we saw in that one picture frame, he looks kind of like us, doesn't he? He's like an older brother or something? I don't know. We have like the same hair. We're getting close to heaven. The land of paradise. Heaven. I thought he said we were going to hell. Are we going to heaven? Were we lied to? Dear God, please protect me. Let me reach heaven safely. Please, I beg of you. You must have died pretty young, Sonny. I lived long enough. I don't have any regrets. But I'll pray that you are able to attain new life. I died? I'm dead? Where am I going? I left my child behind. Where? Okay. Yep. I guess we're going to heaven. Shoop bop bop shoop bop shoop bop bop bop. Are we going to heaven with the little boy who killed us earlier? Huh? You're here too, really? Yay! Awesome. What a great surprise. I didn't think we'd meet again. Yay! Party time. Oh, oops. You gotta be quiet on the train. Shoop up, up, shoop up, shoop up. Trains are really cool. They shake back and forth and you are like a moving room. I'd like to dance with you again. But if we dance in here, we might fall. That'd be scary. Shoop up, up, shoop up. Oh, okay. Alrighty. Door shield shut. too but not when they're like this ahead is the driver's compartment i'm not allowed in there every knows one knows kids are allowed up you cannot escape boy but yeah bet we are gonna break through he really does after everything he's been through with guru, guru and stuff gosh darn oh yeah this train's going to heaven i guess i wonder what heaven's like i hope it has nice people but i really d didn't think i'd ever see you again Honestly, I'm not sure if this is really where you belong yet. But here you are, so I guess you can't do anything about it. Just gotta stay positive. Yeah, I really... I hope this... I wonder... You know, I heard this thing before. Where there's a stage in hell where they trick you that you're in heaven. I saw a, a show, a TV show. It was actually kind of funny. Guess we're here. Kind of nervous. Okay, see you on the other side. Where they trick them into thinking they were ascended into heaven and staged their neighbors, but they were actually sent to hell and they were in fake heaven. So it was pretty cool actually watching that. And this would make as I wonder if that's what's happening. Maybe not. Maybe it's maybe we are ascending. And this little boy's gonna rest in peace finally. That would be nice. That would be like a really good wholesome ending for this game, actually. After everything we've been through. Well, I guess that's it. It's time. Well. It's not, oh. Well, we've been bamboozled, I guess. Dancer's like younger hell god. <laughs> he really is. I thought at first he was related to the... The guy because he has that blue hair right but apparently not you're finally awake that's right you weren't dreaming 
You just got off at the wrong stop. You're going somewhere else. Oh. I see everyone else is going into hell but us. That's great. I love that. That's really nice of them. Seems like we finally arrived. Ready to get off, boy. Ah, hell. Where dreams are made. Wow, what a lovely sight. This boy really doesn't deserve hell. What the heck, dude? He really doesn't deserve to be down here. He deserves to be up in heaven. Path of a pinch. He deserves to be up with Guru. Because I'm assuming Guru's up in heaven. Go on ahead. Wow, this is a lot of bones. We're on our way to hell. That's right, hell. Where you'll become constantly subjected to unbearable torture. Unable to escape or do anything. Simply enduring the pain. With its where hope goes to die. Oh god, dude. But relax. There will be peace after all is said and done. You'll be released from the pain. Look at this mountain of bones. It looks savage at first glance, but their expressions are clearly serene. Though they look like they found peace they longed for. Just look at those smiles. Oh. Oh, of course, I'm sure there are sons who are unsatisfied too. Nightmares are like samsara. The endless cycle of death and rebirth. That's what samsara means. Oh, there was a game I played earlier. And it was called Samsara Room. And I was like, oh, sweet. How the infant and the, the old guy died. I think the symbolism. Of course. It was in the title of the game. The wheel just keeps turning and turning for all eternity. We should keep moving. They're your bones. <laughs> also, I wonder if serial killers think like that. They're like, they were in such agony, but look at their bones. They're smiling so happily. That sounds like a serial killer thing. Go on ahead. Ooh, I don't want to. It seems we're going deeper. Do we have to do another one of those stinking puzzles? Oh, no. It just likes the path. Okay. Whoa. Hey, that's the guy you saw in the picture earlier. This is the final door. Go on inside. Yeah, that's true. The other guy wasn't hit with the scythe. Only we were, so therefore we were casted to hell. I didn't know Reaper's scythe were did that. Like, I didn't know that was the purpose of their scythes. Uh, way to remind me that hell is where all hope goes to die. Thank you. Thank you so much. I like this place. I like what they did with the scenery. It's very nice. I should hire them as professional carpenters. Welcome to the gates of... Ah, she was. Welcome to the gates of hell. A kid this time, huh? Zogs, you sent you down here, right? <laughs> splendid, splendid. I'm Ariman, and I'm your best friend from now on. We'll be spending a lot of time together. We'll cut you to the bone, patch you back up again, care for you, and punish you. We're in charge of everything. Maybe a mother is a better comparison than a friend. A terrifyingly kind mother. But Mama hates it when her kids kick and scream, especially kids who try to escape. No fighting or running now. First, we'll twist your body into one that pleases Mama. Then all the kids here are very obedient. So make sure you're respectful too, got it? You want to see your Mama, don't you? How nice for you. You have a new mother now. The folks behind you are like your mama, too. They're going to care re take real good care of you. Well, I call them mothers. 
But it's not like they're breastfed or anything. <laughs> oh god, dang! He's horrible, he doesn't deserve this. Yeah. I'm assuming this game is based on, like, actual mythology. Like, um, like, actual, like, way you have in hell works and how it sipes and that. A new doll just for us, I can't wait. Unable to even die in agonizing endless pain. Gosh dang, dude. This kid doesn't deserve it. Oops, my bad. He really doesn't deserve it, dude. He freaking... He lost his best friend and this is what happens? What the heck? Man, life is unfair. They were not kidding. Hope dies here. Gosh darn. Oh, he said that was the last door. He's a freaking liar. There's another door right here that we have to go through. Man, I hope it doesn't end where he's got just casted into hell and that's it. I really hope that's not the end. He deserves more than hell. He really does. This boy, he's he's touched my heart, that's for sure. Him and Duolingo B Bird Dragon. It's actually a dragon, but looks like Duolingo. He doesn't deserve to die at all. Tim dying is actually kind of awful, dude. Uh, well, he's already dead, but him going into hell. Like, what the heck? Yeah, maybe, but she just seems weird, doesn't she? I don't like her very much, but maybe she is actually good and she's just a little janked up from the time she was a witch and that she got burnt at the stake or something. I'm not sure. It's hard to say. Yeah, the music was hopeful, wasn't it? Oh, we're back here. We're like the start of the dream. I don't like this. This is as far as I can take you. From here on, a proper escort will guide you. Farewell, boy. This is t it's only been a short while, but it's been a long time since I could chat with someone with as pure of a heart as yours. Thanks. Oh, oh no, the, the key, oh shoot, the dream was the future. Oh, no, he doesn't deserve to be eaten by the kiwi demon thingy, not the kiwi bird. Bro. Bro, I can't watch the kiwi bird doing that to him, I can't. Not after everything we witnessed with this boy. Stop it. Stop it, please. I've changed my mind. I'll keep him in my custody. Kiwi Bird's like, God damn it. You got away this time. But I'll get you again. <laughs> oh! Sorry about that. Hmm. this way a Roblox character what kind which guy the kiwi bird or the 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 reaper you and I are only ones who know about this path got it I think our little white eyeball it's cute all right he's actually a good guy apparently Maybe he's taking us to a better part of hell. Plod, plod, plod. Snape, Snape, Slytherin, Snape, Dumbledore. I don't know why that made me think of that. <laughs> Up ahead in the land of eternal rest, one step before hell, the souls of holy warriors sleep peacefully there. Or so they say the goddess is teaching. It just sounds suspicious. I hope they really are resting peacefully. The goddess. She used to be a normal girl too. Her story is sad. Oh, you might have been right, Azur. About the... About her being a witch or was casted off as a witch. That that might be it. She sees me as her enemy, but... She is... Is she really acting of her own will? Or is she possessed? Like, remember that weird laughing she did? 
By the way, about that cup you're clinging on to. Yes, I mean the Holy Grail. You're going to use that to come back to life, weren't you? If you do that, though, you'll also be turned into a holy warrior. A warrior who is bound to serve the gods. But if that's the only way you can see your beloved mother again, it's a difficult choice, isn't it? Well, no point in agonizing over it. You cannot return to the world of the living anymore. I don't have the power to perform a miracle like that. But I can at least guide you to a certain place. Our character, huh? What what is what Roblox character, huh? I'm actually curious. Asgard. You mean like the I thought Asgard was only a a Norse thing. Is there an Asgard in other cultures of hell as well? Interesting. That's right. Heaven's back door. Ahead is the door that leads to heaven. Huh. I'll go on ahead and prepare for and wait for you. And if you say our character looks like bacon, I will shoot you, okay? I'm just letting you know. Let me get a good look at him. I'm not sure. I guess we- Oh, you mean like like how blocky he is on the side? Yeah. That's true. He kind of is. I mean, if someone made me a custom Roblox character of this little boy, I would probably wear it. Not gonna lie. Wow, this place doesn't look very nice. I thought Asgard was supposed to be all shiny and stuff and pretty. A note has fallen to the ground. It's crammed with writing. Read it? Yes. Oh, yeah, I know what you mean. The Holy Warrior's Memoir. Golden Hair Patrick and Blue Skinned Adolf. Friends who drank the Holy Grail together were restored. Yes, friends. My friends. We were ordered by the gods to engage in mortal combat with demons in the world. And at the end of the fierce struggle, we died and came to Asgard. No one truly knew what it meant to drink the Holy Grail, including me, until it coming here. We merely wished to return to our previous lives, that's all, but it's fine. After all, life here was magnificent. We were had friends, comrades we could sympathize with. We laughed over our past tales of hardships and wished we drank together. See, that sounds like the Asgard, I know. Those days were joyful, surely even more so than our time spent in the world. But one day, yes, I was sharing a drink with Patrick and Adolf as Adolf as usual. Suddenly, of a, a horde of demons in black armor, flying at us from afar, their faces twisted with hatred. It all happened in an instant. I watched as a sharp, blade-like object sprouted from Patrick's stomach, stopping right before my very eyes. Poor Patrick, stabbed by a demon from behind, his guts and drink spilling onto the floor. That's why I tried to pick them up in desperation, to return them back to his stomach, but no matter how hard I tried, they just kept spill spilling. Oh, God, dude. Holy crap. That's actually awful. I was completely seized by fear. I've never seen Patrick look like that before. So I ran from there, abandoning my friends. Yes, I was terrified. Along the way, I found the corpse of a demon and stripped it of its black armor. I doned it in order to fool the demons and hid myself. For a long, long time, I wore that black armor. Even after my friend's screams had faded. We went, when I went out again after what seemed like an eternity, the blue lake I had known was now stained red with blood. All the people and demons have vanished. I was the only one left to walk this land. After that, I was always alone. Patrick and Adolf are gone. Where could they have gone? Recently, I have trouble even remembering their faces. This black armor I stole from the demons seemed to have eaten away at my memories and soul, as if it had a mind of its own. Even if I wanted to take it off, I cannot. It's cursed. This must be my punishment for abandoning my friends. But I don't want to lose all my memories, so I will write them down in this notebook. Mere strings of words that won't return to my true memory to me. Golden hair Patrick, blue all skin date off. I miss them so. Dude. Oh. No, you cannot make the joke of Patrick Starr getting his guts spewed out all over the ground. Oh, gosh. No, dude. Oh, that's revolting. Oh, shoot. Imagine... Oh, now you could imagine it with Spongebob and Patrick going through that. Ooh. 
Uh, so, uh, what are we doing here, sir? This is bad. Very bad. They've come again. I'm terrible at fighting. Ugh. I'm sorry. There's usually a door here that leads to heaven. But apparently it's not working right now. Do you see the monoliths with the emblem of heaven over there? They connect this place to heaven. Normally they shine gracefully, but they seem to be drained now. Poor things. I know what's causing it. The monolith's energy supplies have been shut down. Vile demons are behind this. So the only option is to face them and head on and drive them off with this scythe of mine. Come, necrophage! Oh, his scythe is different than the other guys. Zombs, are you awake? It seems demons have infiltrated this land again. Which means it's meal time. I like the expressions on the scythe. Time to go get them. I'd rather not have to do this. Ugh. Ugh. My age is catching up to me. My legs are completely worn out. Oh, it's been a while since I've walked this much. Let me rest. Oh, God. Oh, I feel the light. Is that the light at the end of the tunnel? It's no use. I can't go any farther today. This isn't good. I need to take care of those demons. Uh, would you possibly go handle them in my place? Yes. You're such a kind, obedient child. That's right. You're a good child with the power to save others. They sent someone like you to hell. I can't accept that. I'm a reaper with moral principles. So you're going to send a child to go fight demons, huh? <laughs> SpongeBob is a sponge. What guts does he have, Sponge? <laughs> Who's a good scythe? Yes, of course. <laughs> Alone. Take my scythe with you. I'm sure he'll aid you greatly. You know, I never viewed a scythe as like a, you know, a dog before. But this guy, I like his expressions. He seems to take a liking to you. Yes, indeed. His name is Necrophage. You may call him Necro for short. All right, come along, Necro. I'm making. Sh I'm emphasizing that so you make sure I didn't say that wrong. The monolith's energy supplies are in different places. It may take some time, but please drive the demons away. It's all up to you. All right, we are almost to heaven. All we have to do is take our little pet, our pet here. And let's go ahead and take them home. That's right. Let's go. Our little pet boy. Music exchange too. What's this? Whoa. Now I wish we had traveling like that in real life. Flashing. Warning. A little late for the warning, but warning it does. Now. 
So I guess here you're showing us that we have to wait for What's the same demon? Actually, it's getting dark. Real dark. Oh, wait. Hold on. Some blue. Oh. Oh, no. He didn't lie to us. Or did he? I don't know. I don't know who I can trust anymore in this game. I really don't. I don't feel like I can trust anyone. It's very peaceful through here, though. We finally made it. Speaking of which, you tried to get off the train to go through Heaven's Gate, right? It was on the front entrance. Sinners can't pass through that door. This is the rear entrance. It's called that because we Reapers use it. Reapers are shunned in Heaven. But this back door will allow anyone through it. It's a lovely door. Now go and pass on to the land of happiness. I'll give you my permission. Alright, well, well, let's do it. Yo, even the goddess is here to bless us. Oh, oh, shoot. I, I told you she wasn't right, dude. What's the matter? I see you're just overjoyed to be able to go to heaven. I'm glad it worked so hard. Oh, my... G goddess. Dude, everyone this boy befriends is dying. Crap, dude. Everyone's dying that he knows. Oh yeah, there's like a little tiny smiley face. Probably because of like just the 
Because I don't mean it. I finally managed to kill you. <gasps> Reaper Zamza. Oh, I'm sorry. Was he a friend of yours? Oh, that's just terrible of me. But those who disturb the order of things must receive punishment. Though I'm grateful to him for saving you from hell. We almost lost you. Our hope for the future. Where do you think you're going? I can't let you go to heaven. Does that mean you belong in hell? My gracious, no. Those who hold the Holy Grail are destined for another place. You want to see your mother, don't you? Then let us return. To the place where you belong. See, she's not a good person. Crap, dude. I can't believe this game is only $4. You know, there are $4 games out there that are legit, like, actual dog crap. I can't believe this is only $4. I really can't. Get it while it's hot. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> yeah, definitely a witch. I think she was um, a, one of the people during the witch trials. I think that was a hint of her backstory. Well, I guess we don't have a choice. It's my body. I hope nothing bad happens when we do this. And that it's just okay and normal. We're alive again! After everything. Jeez. But we lost so many people along the way. I can feel my heart beat. It has to be weird after being dead. Starry Cave. I wonder what language that's in. I'm not sure. I'm really not sure what language that is in. Gosh, like the story hits a little hard. Losing everything he loves is horrible. Here lies Holy Warrior Adolf. Adolf, something's written in the tiny letter. I departed to the world of the void. I had no light, sound, anything. It was, it was horrible. But once I let go, I found peace. Okay. Yeah, she definitely goes get that one. if that demon was Adolf. Well, that was in the afterlife, so maybe that was Adolf. It's quite the path we have to go to get back to our mama. Well, I'm happy at least, at the very least, he'll be able to see his mom again. So that's a good thing. After everything he's been through, it's the least he deserves, dude. What I miss. Long time to see Squirt. It's me, Aramon. You know, the one from hell. Honestly, Aramon sounds like a Digimon being from one. Speaking of which, how the hell did you escape? I gotta get you back to where you belong. Oh, that art is so good, dude. What the heck? You two just think you managed to escape. Hell, how do you sniff out anything? Armand looks really good. You thought you'd get rid of me with that rosary like that? Well, you underestimate me. I tell you to shred, and I'll carry your remains back. Boom! Oh, you underestimate me. You're getting good at this clicking thing. Just don't get deep. Struggling is useless. Playtime is over. Die! Oh. Whoa. What the heck? You see, I, I don't think that Holy Grail was a good one. I don't think that's If he doesn't get to see his mom? Crap, I need tick, dude. Oh, our eyes are red. That's not... I don't know. I don't think that Holy Grail is good for us. 
some undesirable consequences. Oh, this is pretty. Now we're back to the bridge. This time we'll be able to cross it? What happens if we go up to here? Oh, we step away from it, of course. God, dude. I really hope he sees his mom. That's the prayers. He deserves it as a kid. Please tell me that's not his mom's grave. That'd be so fudged up. That'd be really fudged up if that's his mom's grave. Lord into the dark forest. Trapped by a reaper and cast into hell. Saved by the goddess and transformed into a prodigy. That's quite the story. Oh my, I'm impressed that you managed to spot me. I suppose you're no mere human anymore. Still, I wonder how you made it this far. You even got your body back. This is a cross-shaped monument. It was made to honor all the people who throw themselves off this cliff. Unfortunately, it has only succeeded in drawing more people here to commit suicide. Nonetheless, it's an appropriate place for you to meet your death once again, don't you think? If only I haven't come along, this story would have ended peacefully. It is really unfortunate. And you were about to set forth into your wonderful second chance at life, too. I feel like I'm ending a newborn baby's life. It truly makes my skin crawl. Oh, gosh. But I just cannot stop myself. It seems it will be a long time before I release from this nature of mine. Oh. Saitama in the making? It's, I think it's our grave, yeah. Or like a mass grave. And yet, I've become, you've become so very grave. The events of a single night have caused you to grow so much. Lay like that look in your eyes. Don't just stand there, kid. That's the first time someone called us kid and not boy. Hello. Now then, shall we kill each other? The road is too sublime. What about that power? Ain't no night. This is everyone we fought in the past. I do not intend to hold back. If you cannot defend yourself, you are screwed. Or do you prefer to let yourself be killed? Evil people should be subjected to that kind of pain. What a 
was accomplished by the ideas of being men and women, the mass of human resentment is the performing failure. Perfectly. I, you're right. I was really thinking everyone like Yusuka, like how they're twisted in nature. But maybe that's the point of their character. Like, <laughs> actually pretty difficult i did not expect the rosaries to be so versatile oh. i really didn't expect the rosaries to be versatile uh, i can't mess up this again Okay, fast forward through everything faster. Faster, fast forward. Faster. Rapid tap, rapid dash. You must become one with the rapid dash. Tap like my tap is in my hand. Okay, I'm gonna hold my finger toward the top of the screen because yellow spawns up here. I didn't get my face. Did I get it? No? Oh, I think I got it. It's different. It's different. I think I got it. I think I finally got it. <laughs> oh!
Yeah, I know. Every time we die, it's the guy. But this time his eyes are red. Which I find interesting. Obstinate red. Well, he said something different with this guy. Time has come for me to use my reefer scythe, but struggle as I might, I doubt I can beat you. And so I shall summon him. It may anger the goddess, but that does not concern me. We reapers never allow a sinner to evade us. Earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. The Archdemon of Demise is coming. Whoa, his eye, he's, he's bleeding out now. What am I supposed to do? Well, oh, time to continue. Hey there, brother. This is the first time we met. So how does it feel to take in the power of the Holy Grail? Does it feel good? Or does it hurt? I know exactly how you feel. Why, well, once drunk from the Holy Grail, same as you- I'm sorry, I just read your message. I wonder how the aliens cry. <laughs> oh, that was a bad timing of me reading the chat. <laughs> Crap, dude. That, that's awful. I once drunk from the Holy Grail, same as you. That's why we're brothers. Fighting demons until the day we die. A pair of despondent brothers. I threw in the towel long before you, though. This must be Adolf! Because his picture said, don't end up like me. But this opponent is just too much, isn't that right, brother? That cursed reaper, he summoned an abomination, didn't he? We can't win. We have the powers of the grail, but we're only human. And we can't escape either. We'll never break free until we die. Continue? No. No, please. Do I poke his eyeballs out? I mean, you can't see me. No, I Maybe I can get fast. Oh. Oh. Not after everything we've been through, dude. It's the same. Over and over and over and over. We continue. We stand back up until we die. We're nothing but pawns. Disposable pawns, brother. Continue. The bell rings. We fight again. We battle until we die. Like inflatable punching bags. awful face right now. I don't want to see it. I can't look. Help isn't coming. It was the same for me. I'll just toy around with you until you draw your last breath. Continue. What should I say to you, say to you my brother? Oh. 
Is there really no saving him? Yeah, we should, but I'm not sure. Whoa, his face is melting. It's excruciating, horrific. But the goddess won't come out to help you ever again. She makes you drink from that holy grail, and that's the end. She'll never appear again. It's the same for me. That goddess isn't merciful at all. I'm right. So you know how we were going to go to heaven and ascend on to the next life, right? How she prevented it? She's only after her own demands, dude. She's putting us through something maybe even worse than hell. All she needs are pawns to keep fighting the demons back. Salvation is just a flimsy excuse she uses to justify it. Continue. Words are worthless. Nothing I can say would help. Oh, hey. It's a little different this one. This is the little creatures from hell. They're laughing at us. Now. That's not nice. Whoa, he's really melting. Brother, do you believe in miracles? I don't. There are people like us who only ever draw the short end of the stick. Death will come soon. Hitting it only breaks it. This is horrible, dude. Yeah, I really want to exercise the freaking goddess, dude. She deserves death. Let's go. To the tranquil world without sadness or joy or anything. Oh, we're all, we lost all our colors now. And I guess we're in a tranquil world. Bro, this, this kid didn't deserve this at all, dude. Continue. I guess we can't, I guess we go to quick game. He, after everything he did, he lost the will to live. He regained the will to live, only for it to just be crushed completely. Oh. Oh, this is awful. Yeah, I agree. His face contorting was awfully disgusting. Oh, it's the little children. They've come to manipulate our body. Guru? I I feel bad for mocking this dragon at the start. Oh my gosh, he's he's saving us. He's Oh, I feel so bad that we mocked him at the start, dude. He's too precious. Oh, I, I, yeah, I, we'll follow you. I think it is, actually, unfortunately, but it is only $4. Sometimes one ending games are... That, that dragon's too sweet. Final battle. 
This is so cute! Oh, this is everything I was hoping that was going to happen. to die together there but <laughs> oh <laughs> that was, that's the way he dies <laughs> i'll be honest so i went quiet through that because just that was a really enjoyable spot and i didn't want to talk over the music much that was that was really nice See guys, not all mobile games are crap, dude. This this is this is yeah, the power of friendship. Oh. This is so sad and happy. And gosh dang it. We lived. So you know, add off his mistake, he didn't have any friends in the end. Alright, us? We made one. We made many friends who got us through the way. You see? Friendship will last forever and help you guide through some of the toughest times. And hello, am, am I back? Please tell me I'm back. Oh, I didn't realize that. Oh, hey! Hey, oh, we're back. Oh, God. <laughs> this can never go smoothly for me, can it? <laughs> well, I'm back, guys. Um, I didn't realize it stopped recording. My screen went black for a second. And, um, well, I'm glad you guys stuck around. <laughs> We're going to complete the game now. <laughs> it, it can never be a stream with me if there's if it runs perfectly smoothly. I'm not going to lie. Please, don't be so wary. I won't do anything, I promise. Thank you. I did something dreadful, didn't I? I caused a lot of trouble for you as well. After summoning him again, I... Oh, you want to go home, don't you? To where you once were. I apologize, I'm always so selfish. I know you would never forgive me. It is so easy to spew apologies. Putting those sentiments into action is what's genuinely hard. The other me, the reaper side of me, suddenly bursted free. I thought I had managed to prevail over it recently, but when I recall that debacle from just a moment ago, I know I still have a long way to go. I think abandoning my reaper instincts is the way for me to, to atone for what I did to you. And if you, who has received the grail, ever find yourself again like fighting against demons again, I would like to help you. That is all. For now, it seems that it is only the one thing I can do to make amends. I intend to continue watching over lost souls within the old castle. Please come see me any time if you have any troubles. Oh yes, that's right. Let us be on our way. I'm sure you are anxious to return home. I shall guide you. 
Please excuse us. By the way, it seems your friend is waiting for you just farther ahead. Are you that dragon's friend? I've witnessed yet another mystery. With him, it may be possible to survey distant worlds. Surveying the world from up in the sky, even the gemstone could not be more beautiful than that. Now, let us go, so asked Aroth. That's right, you better run after everything you've done. I know, it is really good. This is really good. Oh my gosh, it's, it's hurting my soul, dude. Oh, I hope the other mobile games I found live up to this. I'm not gonna lie. I have a lineup of mobile games. We're not playing them tonight. But, um, do we have to... No, don't tell me we have to jump off to meet him again. Where is he? Where's Guru? <gasps> oh! Oh, he's so cute! Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, this this is hurting, dude. Wow. Oh my god. And there we go. Wow. It is really high expectations of B. It might only go downhill from here. <laughs> I didn't realize I was setting it so high. <laughs> but wow, we. Wow. What a way. What a stamp of saying mobile games are not all bad, dude. Like, wow. Dude. I will say, this is not over yet. There is, um. We have to stay past this. Or. There is an ending scene I'm aware of that's after this. I don't know what it is, but I just know after the credits. That's what they said is to wait through it. He is like a giant puppy. But while this music's going, I'm gonna get my thoughts on this overall. And you all heard it. It's it's a gorgeous, gorgeous piece of art, I think. And in terms of the gameplay and puzzles, I like the simplicity of it. In the rosary, I thought at first it would get repetitive. But honestly, I think they were really clever with how they used the rosaries. They, they had a lot of unique different puzzles with them and each with their own challenges. It was difficult. You'd be surprised. Dude. I know. I, I hope it's not sad, but I don't think they're going to end us on that. I might go quiet just for a little bit, just to enjoy this. And then when we get there, I'll start talking again. It, it 
it has to be something fulfilling at the end, I'm hoping. It can't be. Oh my gosh, we're, we're getting there. Oh my gosh, I'm nervous. I'm, I'm nervous, I'm not gonna lie. If it's a sad note, I don't know if I'm gonna handle it very well. Oh? They really do. It was really gorgeous music and just sitting there and some, I, I like the moments of quiet in this game. And that's why there was moments where I went quiet too, because just you, you need to enjoy it. <laughs> it's the point of it. And oh, fudge, dude, this game's good. It's so well done. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, he didn't. Oh, God. please please tell me something happy. Something happy happens, please. Please. Oh, the dragon wasn't alive during that? The dragon did- Oh, God. Oh, but he reunited with his mother. Oh, it's so bittersweet. Oh, crap, dude. Oh, that is bittersweet. Gosh, darn it. Oh, I thought the dragon would- Oh, gosh. Bro, at, at least we reunited with our mom again. That's... Oh, I <laughs> know. Fudge. That's... Oh. What? Hello? Oh, shoot. It timed me already. A? Eh? <laughs> Congratulations. Your holy royal your rank was A. An astonishing achievement, reflective of awesome reflexes, audacity, and accuracy. Not counting all the times that you had to restart the fights. <laughs> you drove back many demons within the castle. It appears the goddess recorded the results of each and every encounter. But why would she do such a thing? She truly is an enigma and a bitch. Fuck that goddess. I am killing her next time I see her. God damn it. Oh, jeez. Yeah, we passed. But at what cost? <laughs> we passed at what cost, dude? Oh, truly an astounding accomplishment. Yes, yes. Well then, I will now go watch over that boy who has returned to his mother. When demons present themselves to him again, and when he finds himself teetering on the brink of despair, I would like to be there for him. I will have to dispose of this reaper facade by then. One day, surely, I too re will reach those heights and become one overflowing with love like the noble Zanz Zamza. Why did he die, though? Who in the world killed him and where? He is true, it is truly difficult to believe the rage is one that I will continue to carry with me. Till the day I will cut down the villain who killed Zamza with my own hands. How freaking horrible is it, dude, that the, the one he worships his entire life, he killed his friend Zamza. Like, how... 
there is nothing happy in this story. I mean, like, there he met his mom, but at the same time, he is still imprisoned under the goddess, has under his her rule. The dragon, he, I mean, we saw Guru again, but he's he's still in the afterlife. It was his only temporary form, and like, <laughs> dude, that that freaking goddess ruins everything. Till the day when I cut. Oh yeah, I already read that. Now then, I wish upon you a good life filled with joy, O oh, esteemed player. May you avoid the blackened path that will lead you down to me. Whoa, that's a threat. Wow, okay. <laughs> that is a really, really strong game to start the whole find good mobile games. Um, I don't know if I can find a mobile game that, you know, lives up to this. Oh, gosh. I mean, there's the whole, you know, you need friendships. But at the same time, friendships are with you even when they're gone. And, oh, it's so freaking deep. And, like, you know, not everyone's who as they seem and everything. Like, oh, fuck. Fuck, dude. Yeah, Lordy's the right word. <laughs> I, well, thank you guys for sticking around with me. And even to those who went in and out during the stream. I know I had a lot of technical difficulties. <laughs> Streaming mobile apparently doesn't work the best. <laughs> I have to rate that later. I need to give that like a full five stars. But this game's gorgeous, dude. And if you, if you're able to, I, I suggest getting it. It's only four dollars. Well worth it. Well worth it. Yeah, I know. We started off mocking Domingo and was the friend we made along the way, really, like, oh, God, well, <laughs> that's it, guys, I hope you guys really enjoyed it, I enjoyed it, I think this is my most successful live so far, not the whole lie, <laughs> so, I mean, even with the dishes, so, oh, I'll see you guys next time, thank you so much.